Hi all, it's me Nikita again and here I am today with another video for you guys. Just for those of you who have stumbled across my channel recently, I am a band 6 physiotherapist working in the NHS in London, UK and I am also a recent graduate from the Masters in Advanced Pediatric Physiotherapy course from UCL, that is University College London. So diving right into today's content, when I first started searching for Masters in Physiotherapy programs in UK, I found two main types of courses for me. The first one was obviously the pre-registration or the MSc pre-registration physiotherapy courses. And the next one was the MSc physiotherapy courses. So today I'm going to be able to give you the main differences between these two courses so that you can make a right decision for yourself. So difference number one, the course duration. So the MSc physiotherapy pre-registration courses usually last for about two years full-time degrees. So that's a lot of time. But the MSc physiotherapy registrations usually last for about one year in the case of UCL, which was the university that I attended. Or in case of Manchester Metropolitan U University, it was for about 15 months. And in case of Cardiff, it's about 18 months. That is one and a half year. Moving on to point number two. For whom are these courses designed? So the pre-registration courses are designed for individuals who have a background in science but not in physiotherapy. So let me explain. So these are made for people who have backgrounds in health and nutrition, sports, exercise, but not for individuals who have done their undergraduate degree in physiotherapy. Whereas the MSc physiotherapy programs are designed for individuals who have actually done their bachelor's or their undergraduate degree in physiotherapy. So moving on to point number three, do you need IELTS? Well, yes, both the MSc physiotherapy programs and the pre-registration programs both need IELTS. Moving on to point number four, placements. Now, as an international graduate, I personally wanted to do a placement, but obviously this may not be something that you would want to do. So let me just tell you about the two programs. So for the MSc pre-registration courses, you have about two to three placements every year which is about five to six placements over the duration of your course. But again, this is for individuals who have not studied physiotherapy at an undergraduate level. And so the placements help them to become more closely acquainted or more closely associated with the kind of physiotherapy practice that is expected out of them as the course comes to an end. Whereas for the MSc physiotherapy uh, courses, you may or may not have placement. For example, I know that UCL and MNU does have placements in physiotherapy while they are studying, whereas I know Coventry may not really have a placement for students. Now, finally, coming down to point number five, the fee structure. So for the pre-registration programs, the fees can be anywhere between 12,000 and 19,000 pounds per year. Whereas for the MSc physiotherapy programs, the fees can be anywhere between £15,000 to £25,000 per year. But again, what I am giving you is a round figure for the tuition fee. And being an international student, additional fees may apply such as rent, uh, for your accommodation, groceries and all of it. The fees that I've just given you are not inclusive of all of the other fees. These are just tuition fees. So obviously, these were the five main differences between the pre-registration MSc programs and the MSc in physiotherapy programs. Now, beyond this, there are other programs that physiotherapy or international physiotherapy students can choose to do, such as the MSc in global health, the MSc in exercise medicine, the MSc in sports, rehabilitation and injury. But these again depend on personal preferences and may be entirely up to you. So if you are interested in those, please go ahead and search for more information about those programs. Now, if this was of any help to you, if this video was giving you any useful content, please do not forget to hit the like button and like this video. Also, please do subscribe to my videos and share them with anyone you think would be interested in them. If you have any questions related to the content that I shared today or regarding the courses that I shared information with, please drop them in the comment section below. Take care you all. See you. Bye-bye.